Good afternoon, everybody. This is your old buddy Jim here at East Tennessee Preparedness, and I thought I'd make a short video today about uh, everyday carry. And I know I've seen a lot of videos, and people have all kinds of junk on their person. I'm not talking about the bag you keep in your car or your truck, just what you carry on your person. And I try to keep mine simple because I believe in keep it simple, stupid, and it helps me out a lot in life, that philosophy. So what, uh, what does old Jim carry? Carry a lighter, a little big lighter. I have my old timer pocket knife, it's folded. Pretty good little knife. Got it at, I forget where I got it. Keep some uh, chapstick in the winter time on me because of my lips are getting rough shape in the winter. I don't know if everybody can see me. That's probably a good thing. And what else do I have? I usually have my wallet, but I've left it laying somewhere. I always carry this. It's my Smith & Wesson shield. This one has a red dot side on it. It also has front and rear sights also. But it's a good little, good little pistol. I like to have a Glock, but I'm not rich, so I don't have one. And I also keep a little flashlight here. It's got the little bevels on it where if you're a dummy like me and you lock your keys in the car, maybe help you break into your car, but it's a pretty good little light. It's pretty bright. Can you see? Hey, it's pretty bright. And it's small, compact. And I also keep an extra magazine for Freedom Seeds. Which, speaking of Freedom Seeds, I went up to uh, Rural King yesterday up in Virginia, across the state line, because I heard they might have some. But I mean, I stopped Walmart, sporting goods stores, gun shops. Anywhere I go, I cannot find them. So that's also, that's what I carry every day on my person. Usually have my keys. And unfortunately, I have my tobacco in my pocket. But I try to keep this pocket pretty clear. I might shove my car keys or something in there, but that's what I carry with me every day. And, of course, you know I have a bag in my vehicle for if I'm out and get stranded. But I try to keep things simple. I mean, there's no sense overcomplicating it. And one day maybe I'll show what's in my bag I keep in my car. And then I've got my big rucksack. I call it a rucksack. It's a frame backpack. It's pretty large. And I have it. So there is a, one thing I just ordered that I'm going to start keeping. Stop start keeping on my person every day and that's a bleed stop now my bag i keep in my car i told everybody i bought the bear ifac and that is a really good first aid kit and i recommend everybody try to get one of those bear puts out a good product and i have to give credit for md creekmore for the idea on the bleed stop to carry with you every day because i saw his video i can't remember when i saw it i watched so many videos but he carries it like in a shirt pocket, but I don't have many po shirts that have pockets, which might be a good idea to start going get some Carhartt shirts with the t-shirts with the pockets. But anyway, we didn't get to go to church yesterday. We had another uh, COVID event at our church. I know my cousin that's sort of the superintendent of the church has COVID, but he seems to be doing well with it. He's uh, 76 and he has bad lungs from uh an incident when he was a kid so he's I called him Tuesday and he sounded really like he was uh having a hard time catching his breath to, to talk and then I talked to him Saturday and he sounded a hundred percent better so that's good so I'm expecting him he's old and stubborn and hard-headed just like I am so I expect him to make a full recovery so everybody have a great week uh but off today, go back tomorrow, and I'll make a video about, uh, maybe make one Wednesday or something. I try not to clutter up YouTube too much because uh, it's hard for me to come up with ideas for videos. But if you have an idea for a video, and, uh, send me a comment down below. Like I say, if this is your first time here uh, and you like the video, subscribe and ring the bell. Give me a thumbs up, thumbs down. And everybody try to have a good week. I'll talk to you later.